and welcome to the first day of London Fashion Week. I'm Stephanie and we're going to go backstage at Fyodor Golan to check out some of the hair and makeup looks for this season. Let's go. Nail artist Sabrina is in the house for Feel Like Golan. That's right, yeah. Talk me through your funky nails. So today we've taken a twist on the modern classic French. Uh, we've taken the lines slightly longer around the edges, so it's a, a huge smile line, as well as making them a lot thinner, just to make it a little bit more elegant, a little more op opulent as well. And how long does this process take? Because this isn't like a two minute job to me. Well, it's actually quite easy because once you've just got the base colour on, you just literally just whip the a very thin striper brush around the edge of the nail. So it's just quite easy and simple. So long as you just practice, practice, then you can, I'm sure everyone can do it at home. Going for the metallic look. Well, you know, you're in the right place because these guys, Theodore Golan, they've got a an obsession for, well, retro futurism. So what what does that entail in terms of hair, Kenna? Well, do you know they ended up getting back into where the the Transformers have all their ar archives? 1984 was when Transformers were around, which is way before you were around. Hey, I was around when the Transformers were around. I might not have been into the Transformers, but I know what they are. Right, well, fantastic things they are, Transformers. Um, but these guys were allowed to, to access all the archives of the, um, the, the the ones that were written out the story. So they've taken parts, they've taken arms, they've taken heads, and they've like you've, you've just been having a nose, I saw you. I was having a nose around. And they've kind of used them to kind of build their own kind of dog tooth idea by using these different parts. It's fascinating what they've done. How are you feeling backstage? We're waiting for the show to start and actually it's running a bit late. The vibe is amazing, it's really cool. We just did um, uh, Jean-Pierre Braganza and it was fab. Like it's such a different vibe, but it, the, show look, the show looks amazing. So we're just really excited to get them all dressed. Is this your piece here with this uh, transform, glittery it transformer? Is. It is indeed, yeah, it's so cool, so different. It's got such a different vibe to like any of the other shows. I know, it's, I feel like it's really like psychedelic girl. Yeah. Like they're like having so much fun with all these flowers and prints and colour. Yeah, like there's also a lot of like kind of alien vibe going on. It reminds me a lot of Ashish. Like I don't know if you follow their work at all, but like really out there, the colours and the prints so neon, kind of 80s inspired as well. I just think it's really cool. choose to come to the show today? Um, I think Fyder Angolan is just, he's fearless, you know, he's not scared, he's not hes not puppet like the rest of them, you know, he, he, he steps outside the box, he's eccentric and that's what I love, you know, that he has fun with it and that's pretty much our style, you know, we like having fun with him. And what's it like styling your sister? Do you ever feel under pressure like, because obviously it's like, it's not like a client where you don't know them, it's like your sister and you know, th you know them so well, so does that make it easier or harder? Easier, because she'll tell me if she doesn't like it. Um, but no, she's really easy to dress and I love it. Yeah, it's fun. So we have just seen the photo of Glowland show for Spring Summer 2016. And I've got to say, it was really eclectic. We saw lots of bright, vivid, popping colours, metallics, gems, embellishment, you name it. The designer had it on the runway. It's not for the faint-hearted, more for those of you that like a bit of quirky street style, but it certainly will make you stand out from the crowd. So that's all I've got time for today, but you can catch me next time for more fashion news. See you soon.